Karan, is this your quarantine look? Totally, I'm hiding myself behind so many things. Can't you see? A mask, shades. In fact, I was wearing a cap also before this. And I have a shield ready in case I have to meet someone. That's perfect. So tell What's me, up? you took the first flight from Bombay to Delhi huh, yesterday? Yes, that was the first flight uh, flying out of Bombay to Delhi. And uh, a very good experience because uh, the crew and uh, you know all the other <coughs> essential workers at the airport were really helpful. And uh, at the Mumbai airport, I was uh, screened. There was a self-declaration that I had to sign on the app, which uh, says that I don't have any symptoms and I'm healthy to travel. Uh, so that was a good part. Uh, though landing in Delhi, uh, I was expecting that there'll be uh, some medical staff who will probably test me uh, for COVID uh, or at least let me know about the quarantine <coughs> plans and how should I go about it. Uh, but again, just seeing it from popular belief and uh, reading it and seeing it on internet, I've self-quarantined myself for about 14 days at home. I met my mom through a glass door and uh, we've had breakfast sitting really far off at the you know two ends of the table. So this is how life is. We are conversing almost as if I'm from Bombay. and So we talk on the phone from here and then we look at each other. And uh, this is the time to work out. So I'm going to go on the terrace and work out and she's going to work out somewhere in the balcony. <laughs> uh, it's a very that's, different that's the plan. experience. Huh? It's like living a life from a, a you know a science fiction movie. I've never seen Delhi airport, uh, Delhi and Bombay airport like this. Deserted and as if I'm, I'm sleepwalking through some uh, movie set. It was really sad. Even the Bombay roads for that matter. It took me like three minutes. Uh, luckily a very good friend of mine had dropped me. Uh, he took the initiative that you should not take a, a public uh, cab or anything right now. I'll come over. So he dropped me. And um, again, it took about three minutes to reach the airport, which usually takes about 40 or 35 okay. because of the traffic. Absolutely. Uh, anything in particular that you uh, went to Delhi for? Like, were you in a hurry to reach uh, Delhi? Or was it to meet uh, mom and sister? Yeah, just to be with my mom and my nephew, uh, who will probably see after 14 days now. Uh, but uh, primarily, again, for my mom, she's uh, a senior citizen, 65. And I was getting fried there in Bombay, though I luckily have had a house help. Uh, but again, just being at home and uh, not able to meet anybody, not go to the gym, nothing. So that was one of the reasons I, I believe. I can understand the plight of all the migrant workers. They're not even, uh, you know, getting proper food to eat. So I believe, matlab, I'm the, I'm also one of the migrant workers, but again, in a, in a, in a different way. <laughs> so I can totally understand people who are stuck and not able to reach to their uh, villages and everything. How they must be feeling. So you plan to stay there for a couple of months, maybe till work resumes here. <clears throat> of course, till work resumes. As I say, Mumbai is Karam Bhumi, and I love the city, of course. I so badly want the whole vibe back, you know, for the whole world. I can imagine what people are going through just sitting at home and waiting for this pandemic to pass. Um, but I can't wait to be back and uh, especially get my mom along with me because I've moved into a new place and I've done that up but she's not seen it. So, in fact, we were in uh, transit to getting her to Bombay to show her the place while this happened and I had to come here. So, once I go back, I'll go back with her and I'll show her the place and be there. And uh, I believe Udhavji has met some uh, big wigs from uh, the TV industry. And uh, shoot shall resume June end. That's what they're expecting. I just spoke to my production also for which I'm shooting at the moment. And they said June end is uh, at least 15 June ke baad they'll let us know exactly the, what the schedule is. So I'm hoping that happens soon and everybody's back and the vibe comes back and everybody's hale and hearty. Totally. Everyone's hoping for that and uh... Let's hope that happens yeah. soon. So, uh, maybe for now, yeah. you can go back to the quarantine look. Yeah, man. <laughs> Those are the safety measures. <laughs> because you may not need to use them while you are uh, in your room. But yeah, while I'm inside, I'm home. But I, I'm already ready with a lot of things in case somebody comes because I've asked for a lot of deliveries. So okay. if I'm going to pick up something like, like my yoga mat has come, 
my uh, skipping rope, my dumbbells I've ordered. So some things have come, so I'll have to be geared up before I meet and I get them. 